I'm Joe McNally. We're here in a photo studio today discussing the principles of TTL flash using the Profoto off-camera flash system. Now you see behind me a five-foot RFI Octa. It's fitted with a Profoto B1, which is a monolite battery-operated system, right? And I've got TTL control over it. If you see that size of light, especially in a studio, Historically, you would say, oh, that's a manual light. I have to go over and adjust that light. It's got manual controls only. But the beauty of the Profoto system is not only it's got this tremendous array of light shapers, it also has now the new technology of TTL. So I'm able to stay here at the camera with an air remote and talk to that light. All right, relax for a second. TTL, through the lens. It means, basically, that the camera is judging flash exposure relative to what the camera actually sees. So the only information that is being translated actively into judging the exposure of the flash is, in fact, the frame of the camera. The camera discerns the information that it views through the lens and then uses that to factor the flash exposure. There are two flashes that are involved in every exposure. One is called a pre-flash, which emanates from the flash prior to the actual exposure. What that does is it illuminates the field of view of the camera and gives the camera's brain something to chew on. Information you know, about color and reflectivity and all that kind of stuff that the camera needs to ascertain to tell the flash how to behave. So what the camera and the flash are doing basically is having a conversation. The pre-flash pops out and the camera judges that and then it sends a signal back to the flash. This is how much light to put out or how little light to put out. It is actually a conversation that the two units are having. Here's what you do with a location. It's like peeling an onion, right? You don't leave until you get all the layers of it done. And with a TTL system like this, it's perfectly tailored to do that kind of maneuvering because you are moving fast and the system keeps up with you. Here we go. Group A, channel one. One light, it's with a OCF um, umbrella that's got a diffuser wrap on. It's kind of like an umbrella box, some folks would refer to this light. Here we go, man. Cool, good look. Okay, and kind of why I do TTL. First frame, right out of the box. Gets me in the ballpark. This is a perfect frame. I don't really have to do too much, <laughs> which is nice. You know, I can concentrate on the aesthetics. I can concentrate on the emotion. I can concentrate on paying attention to my subject. All right, so kind of proof positive. I just went from 5.6 on the fly to 1.4, and there was no change in the exposure. I mean, there was obviously a change in the way the light handled itself. The Air Remote took that information from the camera, decoded it, pumped it over to the light and the light responded. So I went to 5.6 to F1.4 on the fly.